bad vocals. You can sing along, it has no words. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it's called Arisa Mollify. After that, I'm going to go into a gavut from Britney. Then after that, I'm going to play you a tune called Killers of Fun. I wrote this tune in February in Montreal at the Folk Alliance International. So what you're supposed to do there, you're supposed to do two things. Two Retain things. Your fiddle. Yeah, well, that's three, actually. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's Montreal. It gets cold and it goes out of tune a lot, so three. Um, Retain your fiddle, network, and play music. So I was doing all three of those things in Montreal, and I'm jamming with this guitar player from Winnipeg, and somebody flings open the door and is like, stop, you're too loud. What? <laughs> too loud? What do you mean too loud? That's crazy. Come oh, on, man. Yeah, too loud. Anywho, um, wrote this one for her. <laughs> Smite the non-believers. <laughs> so this one's for her. After that is a tune called The Atlas Obscura. Anybody heard of The Atlas Obscura? It's the greatest travel resource ever after the plane. Um, it's awesome. Like, it, it, say you're traveling here to Maine, yeah? It's not going to tell you about Acadia. It's going to tell you, like, oh, Friars Brew Pub. It's a bunch of friars who make beer and bucks for it. Well, yeah. Pretty cool, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, also, like, if you're traveling in Rome, say it's not going to tell you about Coliseum. It's going to say, here landed Icarus when his wings fell. <laughs> That's a real place, man. Where he landed. <laughs> <laughs> There's still wax there, so crater. Yeah, so, so after that, yeah, I'm going to play those tunes. Uh, I'm going to send this one out to my grandfather, Grump. Uh, he would have been uh, 76 today. Yes, sir. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Grump. Is that, is that the fill you're playing? No, it's a uh, different one. Different, that's my great grandfather. But yeah, Grump was always a big supporter of my music. He, um, I used to play with a guy called Peter Lindquist, and he, yeah, he, he was the first to hear the stuff that we recorded. I, we used to record practice demos. I'd give them to him. And he always said, "I like that slow one. I like those slow ones." <laughs> so I'm uh, gonna lead it off with a slow one for Grump, and uh, some tunes after that. And then after that, Matthias is gonna come make noise with me. <laughs> what do you mean, man?